We should have flown. You know, we could be there in eight hours instead of eight days. Relax. You'll be glad you drove. Plus, I told you I'll pay for gas. You mean your parents? Whatever. They paid for gas and I bought my plane ticket home. Look, you're not the one paying. I mean, I just, I figure I started two weeks, right? Exactly. So what's the rush? Giving out goodie bags in there? What's that noise? Oh, that's just Shelly. Sometimes she talks back, gets me sass. What'd you get? Seven shots. I got one too, that's all we need. San Francisco is over 3,000 miles away, and do you want to cover the whole trip with 54 miles per hour? Can you believe that? They clocked me doing 54 and a 45. I mean, that's just called driving, costing me 250. Felix, we've known each other for 13 years. Have I ever gotten a ticket? Yes. When? Right now. <laughs> I'm serious! I mean, your parents said they'd cover gas, so did they say anything about tickets? Yeah, not to get one, verbatim. Okay, well then I'll cover you. Oh, of course you can. This is nothing to you, Mr. Salesforce. You know what? Why don't you let me take the wheel, okay? I don't think getting a ticket 15 minutes into the drive is very economically sustainable. for 45 minutes and we've already stopped three times. Gas, cop. That one was you. Yeah, I know. Looks like you're not in much of a rush after all. <sighs> they get back to you? Yep. On to the next. Sorry, G. It's not like it was anything big anyways though, right? No paying. I mean, Low salary, but I would have been able to travel for work. That's kind of my dream. Yeah, but I mean, it didn't have anything to do with your major. And besides, traveling without money, it's not really a way to see the world. What do you think this road trip is? It's gonna pay itself off in a week. <laughs> of course it will. It's gonna be a rough week though, like every week you're there. Won't be able to do this every day. Money makes memories. Bunch of lines. Those are roads. Hey, why'd you even get that anyway? Felix, this is a road trip. Plus, it was free. I don't even know where we are on this thing. The Google knows. Punch back, you know, punch ah. back! <laughs> oh, Georgia! <laughs> Driving. So. Last time you'll be in New York for a while, huh? Yeah. No more seasons changing, snow, apple picking. You know, replacing it with wine, palm trees, the ocean. You know, the life.
Looks like an ocean. Yeah, some lake, huh? You know, some would say that it's quite eerie. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad we're doing this. Me too. I'm excited. But not for Kansas. We'll get through it. You know, I've always wanted to do this. See the country. There's even more than just this country. Yeah, I know. I want to see that too. Why don't you? Time. Money. I just don't think it's that easy. I don't think it needs to be that complicated either. I mean, why not? I don't want to wait. But you don't want to go broke. I'd rather go broke and make it happen than save up and never do it. Where are you off to first? Europe. I've never been and always wanted to go backpack in Switzerland. When are you going? There's just a couple of things I have to figure out first. Logistics, it's... Not that easy. Yeah, I know. You can visit me once I'm there. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Might not be a penthouse, but a pullout will do. Indeed. <laughs> Pittsburgh tomorrow, huh? I've never been. It's okay, we've only got four more bags. Can you ever have too many marshmallows? After $20 worth, maybe. <laughs> Hey, remember when Luna couldn't get the fire to catch, so JT, being the badass he is, tried to dump a lighter fluid on it and singed off his eyebrows? <laughs> I wasn't there. No, you were. It was on our camping trip, remember? To Zion with Chelsea, Quinn, Ty. Why didn't you come on that? Busy. Always busy. What? I just said you were always busy. You never hung out. That's not true. Our schedules just didn't align. Yeah, they didn't align when you were too busy in your room, on your computer, your phone, doing whatever, and never really put in any time for anything or anyone else. College is supposed to be a highlight of your life, was it? It's not a highlight for everyone, and you know that. Yeah, it's not for everyone, obviously. But we're young. No actual obligations yet. It's our first glimpse of freedom. And you only cared about grades and shit that won't even matter in five years. And that's why I have a job. Congrats on the job you don't even want in a city you don't know. Thanks. I'll text you how it's going while you're unemployed with practically nothing to show for it because you had some mediocre adventures in college. I mean, you want to talk about adventure? I'm going to explore a new coast while you are back in your childhood bedroom. Gee, I'm sorry. Fuck you, Felix. Do you know how many times I just wanted to hang out with you, do something fun? Did you ever consider what I thought was fun? What? Working? You literally have your whole life to do that! Okay, you want to go see the world? Then go right now and buy a plane ticket. And then you can buy a hotel room and then buy yourself a fucking meal. Yeah, exactly. You can't. You're right. I can't. But you never will. You don't know that. When? Your two-week per year vacation? That's paid, too. Paid! Yeah, whatever, Felix. Can't you just be happy for me? Can't you be supportive? Are you serious? I have always 
been there for you. I have to schedule a fucking week in advance to hang out with you. I had to literally plead with you to come on this road trip with me. And here I am, okay, in the middle of bumblefuck Pennsylvania with you. Is this what you wanted? All I was trying to say was that I wished you had hung out more, but all you ever cared about was work. Honestly, congrats. You got what you wanted. I hope you're happy. Georgia, Georgia, the whole day through, just an old sweet song, <laughs> keeps Georgia on my mind, Georgia on my mind. I'm still mad at you. I, I know. Georgia. Engine's fucked. Right there. Okay. Uh, pointing at it and saying it's fucked doesn't really help me. Head gasket. Some serious shit, buddy. What's fixing that look like? Three, four... Hundred dollars? I do not have that money to blow it. Seventeen hundred dollars to replace it. And that's a deal. I don't know, she's a nice ride otherwise. Some beautiful parts on it too. How much? Just told you. How much for the car? Felix, what? How much would you pay for it? Dude, what are you doing? Are you serious? We'll sell the car and buy flights. We can get to California, no problem. Felix, no. What about the trip? This is just part of the adventure. Okay, we'll take the money. All you care about is money. And then we will buy a beater car once we get out there. I'm gonna need it anyway to explore out west. This is our chance, okay? I'll cover you. This was supposed to be the last adventure we had together. Not forever. Besides, I would rather be out west with you than stuck in Pennsylvania. Look, I've been doing this thing where I blow you off and all I care about is work. I know, okay? You're right, I don't have a balance. I need to work on that. I'm sorry, G. I know we can't go back to living in the same small college town, but right now we can really do anything we want. It's not about where we go. It's about the time we have together. How much? I'll give you eight. Ten. No. Felix, fucking bargain with him. Say nine. Nine? Deal. Yes. Okay, let's go. <laughs> How tall do you think this mountain is? I have no fucking idea, okay? You've asked that about every landform taller than 20 feet. 20 feet? Seems like you have an answer up there somewhere. I wonder what's between Pittsburgh and California. Hmm. Illinois. Maybe Colorado in there somewhere. We'll fly over them in a couple hours. Promise me we'll land in them one day too. Georgia. 
I've taken three photos on this thing and I've got to fill it up somehow. 